I'm Dr. Mark Jagger, creator of The Spine Specialist, and I would just like to address uh, one of the common questions that keeps coming up. Is what we do a scam? Seems like kind of a funny question. So in order to address that, you know what? Uh, that question's been asked. And to the ones that have asked it, you're right. What do I mean by you're right? You're right to be skeptical. If you weren't skeptical, that would mean you weren't thinking for yourself. And the fact that you are skeptical, the amount of treatments that we've done since 2007 in our clinic stand up to any type of scrutiny that anyone could ever have towards laser enhanced spinal decompression. And so far to say that we actually develop the spine specialist, which is a robotic laser enhanced spinal decompression device out of a need for better results, out of a need for something different that wasn't, uh, that wasn't in the field at the time. So that's why I created it. That's why I designed it. That's why the thought popped up in my head. And I understand skepticism. I understand skepticism very well. Um, because again, it's just, you know, somebody uh, critically thinking about things and wanting to know in most cases. Um, if I wasn't a critical thinker, uh, if I wasn't an inquisitive mind, then I never would have developed the device in the first place because I wouldn't have wanted for any new information. I wouldn't have wanted for anything different and more advanced. I would have taken the lasers that other companies built. I would have taken the decompression that other companies built and I would have just used it because I would have figured that's the only thing that's available. Um, my thinking with respect to knowing that I could do something better and wanting more information and eventually wanting to develop that for patients, it came out of a skeptical mindset. So, you know, you're right to ask questions. If you didn't, you wouldn't be thinking. So thank you for asking those questions. Thank you for being skeptical in the first place because it gives us the opportunity to explain why the spine specialist is different than other things that you may have experienced and why our resolve is different than many other clinics that you may have experienced. We didn't spend the last nine years and counting um, developing this device for no reason. Where it comes from, uh, if we want to back up into my history a little bit, uh, I've been in this field a long time and there are a lot of things within the field that, you know, are, I don't want to use the word scam, but borderline questionable. And many people have tried things that haven't worked, which of course will make them skeptical. So that's a natural response. Now, is what we do a magic bullet and we'll fix everything? Absolutely not. And in fact, if anyone ever tells you that, you should be skeptical right away and you should actually run the other way because nothing is a magic bullet. Um, will it take some work in most cases to get you better regardless of the advanced technology? Absolutely. You gotta put work into it as well. So. I'll give the analogy of going to the gym. So I bought a gym membership and I haven't been able to lose any weight. Well, how many times have you gone? Oh, I go like once every two weeks. Well, did you put in the work? No, you didn't put in the work. You didn't do what was necessary. You had the opportunity, you had the gym. You could have used it, but you didn't. So you need to put in the work. Um, and I guarantee you will put in the work to make sure that we do the best that we can do for you. So. Again, backing up where this comes from is at a young age, 14 years old, I watched um, my uh, father's fatal injury, unfortunately, uh, unfold in front of me. And that left me with loss. That left me with a profound sense of loss. Now, thankfully, I was able to come back from that. I had some great support from family, um, etc. cetera, but um, still that loss I felt. And when I went into practice, I noticed there were a lot of families that were experiencing this loss. Uh, they had members in chronic pain. They had lost members to chronic pain due to overdoses of, of drug and due to uh, self-harm, due to suicide, things like that because of chronic pain. So those families were experiencing profound loss as well. And I remembered as a child um, how that felt. And I thought, wow, you know, if I can bring some of these people out of pain, help them, um, I may be able to head off that loss. So I may be able to stop loss for families so they wouldn't have to experience what I experienced. So that is really where it comes from. We didn't spend nine years 
and counting of our lives up to this point. Uh, time away from family, no vacations, uh, being at the shop till 3 a.m., uh, perfecting something on the machine that I wanted to design, potentially, you know, losing a finger. Just kidding, I got all my fingers. Um, we didn't do that for no reason. Now, we understand skepticism. It's natural, and we're actually thankful for it. Um, there is a ad that I like to always come back to. It's called Penalty of Leadership. And it was a Cadillac ad way back uh, in the 50s, I believe, uh, when Packard had come out with Cadillac, or, uh, against Cadillac and um, was gaining more market share. Cadillac had a problem with their engines, from what I remember, and um, they were losing market share to Packard. In a last-ditch effort, they came up with this ad campaign, and it won them back the market share. And what it was, essentially, is when you lead, people will be skeptical, people will copy, people will try to do what you're doing because maybe they don't understand how great it is what you're what you're doing maybe they're jealous maybe there's a lot of different reasons why leadership is difficult and we're leading this profession we've done something that no one has ever done in the course of history combine robotic laser and spinal decompression to try to help patients get better faster and that's really why we did it we've led the profession to doing something like this, developing a device that works in ways other devices cannot, for you, for patients, to help get better. Now, is it a magic bullet? No, I went over that. Um, it does help a lot of people that haven't had results with other things. So, what are we? We're a group of practitioners that want to use unique devices to help patients in ways that they have not been helped thus far. So if you're a patient that has experienced this, tried everything, then this is another thing to try. This is another tool in our clinical toolbox that might be able to help you. It's not magic. We don't claim to be able to treat everybody and be able to fix everybody. Nothing ever works like that. Think logically, you know that's true with anything. So we would never claim to be magic. We claim to sincerely want to help. That's what we claim. We will always do our best to make sure that we help you in any way we can. So what you have is, is this a scam? No, it is a group of practitioners that are sincerely committed to helping you get better. So we look forward to meeting you. We welcome you to Spine Specialist Clinics. We welcome any questions you have. We welcome your skepticism. There's plenty of research, plenty of cases, plenty of patients to back up that what we do is valuable and helpful, and we hope sincerely that it will be valuable and helpful for you. Thank you for watching this video. Uh, please email, di direct any questions that you may have to us. We would be happy to engage with you and help you any way we can. Have a wonderful day. Thank you for watching. Thank you for your questions.